everyone! How are you guys doing today? So today I am once again playing Minecraft and um, I appear to be in a boat with a pillager in. Um, excuse me sir, my pillager prisoner right here. Can you please not shoot me? I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to execute you. Sorry, you're gonna have to die. You're gonna have to die for your crimes. Woo! There, he's dead now. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry you guys had to see that. Anyway, um, welcome back to my Minecraft world. Um, yes, I know it is raining, but that's okay because I wanted to use my new Riptide Enchanted. I thought it would be nice to show off my Riptide Trident, so I'm going to use that. Whoa, you can probably show high with this. Whoa, I'm spinning and my voice cracked. Oh, we're getting a little... I'm getting really high here. Look at this! Um, okay. Slight problem. I'm a little bit too high now. We're... Oh, no. It's snowing. Oh, no! I'm falling! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Woo-hoo-hoo! Oh-ho! Oh, that was scary. Oh, thank goodness I have my panda hair. Okay, anyway, we have a lot to do. A lot to do today. Uh-oh. I landed in the sweet berries. Anyway, in the last episode, at the very end, I mentioned that I might build an iron farm. Well, I stuck to my word, and I have built an iron farm. We just gotta get there first. So we have to take the... I don't even know what to call this, this is the minecart track that originally went to that um, other taiga village but I like kind of redirected it so now oh look look we installed like a, 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 a chimney <laughs> that's fun anyway um we're gonna go to the iron farm because this track um leads to there hello Gonaldo I haven't seen you in a while nope anyway we are just about arriving at the new iron farm, which I built out of episode. You can see there are a lot of poppies. <laughs> a lot of roses. Oh, I think an iron golem just, um, just, uh, um, became no longer living due to my farm. Anyway, um, welcome to the little space I have. I have all the, um, stuff you might need. Um, I covered it in leaves so mobs um, can't spawn. And you go down here, this is all made of iron by the way, you go down here, there's a chest that has um, all of the iron you could ever want in it. And it occasionally um, gets gunpowder, rotten flesh, bones, arrows, and string. I don't know why, but I think occasionally like a creeper might like you know, jump into the farm. And how it works is there's villagers underneath here. I didn't design this, by the way. Um, there's a lot of tutorials out there for bedrock iron farms. But anyway, uh, uh, iron golem would spawn right here. They would go right into the lava, <laughs> as I'm about to um, do. Okay, yep, just like that. Just a little burn. And then um, they um, become no longer living due to the farm. Okay, that goes in the hopper, then the, oh no, then the items go in the chest, and yeah, uh, that's kind of my iron farm. This lava is scaring me a lot. Woo! Oh no! Oh. This, this riptide trident is fun, I haven't used it yet. Woo! You need to be careful though. Anyway, anyway, I should probably explain what we are doing today. So today, oh, <laughs> so today, um, we are going to be building another shop. Well, I guess you could call it a restaurant. We're going to be building a, a cafe. Anyway, as soon as Minecraft would like to join us, uh, we can start building. So as we wait for Minecraft to load in, as I am just in the nothingness, we're going to be building two things. One, we're going, oh, there, <laughs> welcome Minecraft. We are going to be building a new um, shop. It's going to be a coffee shop. It's going to be a cafe. 
and it's going to be run by cartographers, so it's going to be called Cartographers Cafe, and two, we are going to be building a new road. So I thought this is kind of like, you know, my town square, my kind of like main street, you know. So I thought I could build a realistic road going through here. So that's exactly what I'm going to do for the first half. So here, um, we're going to have stone slabs because it's cheaper. And then we're going to place these like all the way down. And that will make our road. And then, as I slowly pan across, this is where I am going to make the coffee shop. There. So that's kind of where the coffee shop will end, like right there. So I'll just build the road out to there. And then we'll be caught up with the road. So I'm going to be using carpet. And then under the carpet, I'm going to put um, some torches to light up the place. And I'll probably do like this out of episode two because it's kind of boring to watch so you don't have to watch too much more and to make this road it means i had to flatten out a lot of stuff so yeah if you if you remember if you don't it's okay but if you remember there used to be kind of like a little hill here i had to completely flatten that out and even flatten a little bit of that out so eventually this all will be like shops but we have to do one shop at a time and that's what we're going to be doing today uh, see, look, this is gonna be nice. Unfortunately, there aren't any cars in Minecraft, so no one's gonna be really able to, like, drive on this road. And also, it doesn't really make sense, because the road, like, leads into my house. <laughs> Dude, I don't, I don't really get it. You, you don't have to get it. It's kind of dangerous building a road in the middle of the street, isn't it? <laughs> Oh no, the sky's clear. That means I can't use Riptide. <laughs> if you don't know what Riptide is, and if you don't, then, well, I'm going to tell you it's okay. Um, if you're in any sort of water, um, whether it being rain or, like, a lake or something, any, like, water, um, you can put your trident out, and um, if you let it go, you'll fly into the sky. Oh no. <laughs> and... <laughs> if you don't have any pair of wings or anything, then you'll just come crashing down. If you would want to build a road, I don't recommend in real life building a road out of um, carpet, out of w woolen materials, because if people drive on a <laughs> road that's made out of woolen materials, I don't think that's going to end well. Okay, so this is what the road should, lo should look like. Just picture this, without the zombie and the spider, going all along there into the sunset, even though it is nighttime and I'm getting attacked. Everyone got that? Everyone clear? Okay, I don't care if you're not. Ah! Hello, may I help you? This is a store, please, please, sir, please. No, please, don't climb over the counter... Don't climb over the countertops, please. Would you like to buy some woolen products? The store's being robbed! <laughs> Alert the authority. Cartographer's Cafe. Visit the entire world in just one coffee cup. I don't know. We're working on the slogan. So I built this in another in another world, and then I um took pictures of it. So now I know how it is going to go. This is the door. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's hard to see what I'm building when I can't see. Oh, is that a skeleton? Why? <laughs> Don't hit me like that. Are we cool? Anyway, that should be the barrel rim done. Okay, where are the windows going to go? Let me look at my phone. <laughs> I got a dark oak door. Place that down. I can't see it. Anytime now, Minecraft. Anytime now. Why can't I ever see what I'm doing? So yeah, that's the door. Glass pan. Glass. Pan. Glass. Then there's going to be a big window in the back. We'll worry about that later. But we have to put on top uh, stairs. Put some stairs on top. Okay. This seems really precarious. This is really precarious. I can't pronounce precarious right. Oh, no. I wish I brought an axe with me. You know, I'm going to go get an axe. I'm going to have to get a diamond one. Oh. I don't know why I'm being so lazy. Oh, yeah. 
the room that we built in the last episode, it still looks pretty good. But anyway, I was trying to say, I don't know why I'm so lazy. I just have to go up a ladder. Okay, all my diamond equipment. I'm gonna use good old Lost in Vegas. Whee! You didn't think there was slime box there, didn't you? You thought I was just j jumping off the roof. Oh, well that time I did. You know, I think the cafe and the street mostly is gonna look really good. There's kind of like a drop off here. If I like continue to pass that, almost build like an above water road and just continue it into like, just like the horizon. Okay, that's one lantern, two lantern, three lantern, and five lantern. Wait, what? I'm not good at counting. I don't know why, I just think that kind of like looks good if I do it like that because it's like alternating. It kind of gives like more depth than just doing like glass panes. Well, really, I was like, oh, I don't know what to do. I don't know where to do glass panes or glass blocks. Because in my mind, the weird part of it was just like, why not both? And I'm all like, eh, why not? And then I did it and I thought it looked cool. So I kept it. So yay. done okay we're lacking a roof but don't worry that'll be solved soon if we have the budget if we don't have a budget for a roof that's okay <laughs> i'm okay with that basically. when it rains it doesn't matter the food's gonna get wet but we're gonna have some tables and some oak chairs next one two three okay we put a chair there and the chair not there is that right yep uh, yep, that's right. And then we have the chairs, that, and then the table, like that. There we go. We're gonna add some trap doors. Place them down and flap them up. Place them down, flap them up. Place it down and <laughs> I did it wrong. If these are flapped down, they're no blocks apart, but if you flap them up, they're kind of two blocks apart. Not technically, but I think you can see what I'm saying. Hopefully you can hear what I'm saying. Because I am. Because due to my dental equipment, I am slurring my words. So that is a lovely, lovely, lovely wooden desk that all the cartographers are going to be, were going to be there. And then they can sell you coffee and maps. And by the way, when I say cartographer, I mean there's a villager. That's the cartographer. Okay, and then some carpet. Okay, this is a two-sitter, although you can't really, like, sit, you can't, you can't really sit, fit in the seats, but, you know, just use your imagination a little bit. This is a seat. That, and then, if I'm looking at my photo here, then, then, okay, then this, okay, then I saw this at a restaurant in real life once, do that, and then that, and then that, and then that, yay! Okay, this is looking good. There's a lot of seating. Over here, we're going to do the exact same thing as the other side. But we're, <laughs> we're going to do it in style. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, no, wait, that's not right, is it? Uh-oh, what went wrong? Oh yeah, did you see that speed? Boom, boom, boom. So that is all of the seating done. Now, I don't think we're going to be able to finish this in one episode. I think it's going to take a couple. So I'm just going to get the ceiling done. And then in the next episode, which um, there's going to be a pretty big gap between this episode and the next episode. Because I am actually going to Florida. So there is a 50% chance that I might do like a vacation vlog, but no promises. You gotta have a roof over your head, don't ya? D don't, don't ya? Well, hello, Mr. Spider. Oh, whoa! <laughs> don't you think it looks cozy in there? 
Doesn't it look all good and cozy in there? Anyway, in the next episode, we'll finish it off. But as I said before, there's going to be a longer gap between this episode and the next one. Can you please get out of the way? Thank you. <sighs> hey! Hey! Get out of the way. No spiders allowed. I'm sorry I spit at your face. No skeletons either. Oh, you think they're so... You think you're so good. Ah, good bah. No. Hey. Ah, ah, oh no. Ah, ah, ah. Get out of here. Ah. We do not serve spiders in here. So as I'm filling in the rest of the roof, Hopefully not to be attacked by spiders. I would like to explain a little bit more about this restaurant. Because I feel like I have enough already. So, right there, we are going to have a cartographer villager. He'll sell you coffee, and he will sell you maps. And it's kind of like a world traveler, map maker, you know? So if you want to travel the world, but you can't, you know, you need to come here and get a map, but while you're at it, you better as well get a cup of coffee as well, you know. Coffee for the road, <laughs> literally over there. But yeah, get your coffee, look at the map, go to wherever the map and the wind may take you. And then at the top, at the, kind of like, the, like, you know, the roof, we're gonna put a big old, like, kind of like, um, globe. And that's what I'll be building in the next episode. But as I said, Twice before already, you're probably getting tired of hearing this. There will be a longer gap, because I will be on vacation. Don't be alarmed if you don't hear from me in a while. I bet you want to know where I'm going. You know, I'm going to keep it a secret. I'm going to Destin, Florida. I just... Okay, now that the roof is all done, we're kind of lacking some lighting. So let me put some temporary lighting in here. But yeah, that's pretty much... Uh, the cartographer's, um, cafe interior almost completely done. So I would like to thank all of you for watching today's episode. I really had fun recording it. Woo! Woo! I landed on the ship. That guy also has a trident. Ah, oh, there are monsters attacking me. Hey, another pillager prisoner. Away! And away! Oh uh, yeah, in the next episode, we'll be finishing off a uh, cartographer's cafe. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, please like and subscribe for more content similar to this, and I will see you all later. Goodbye! Ow, that hurt.